and welcome back to our Mississippi State Bulldogs Dynasty and NCAA Football 2003. Today we're wrapping up the regular season of season number nine as we take on our arch nemesis Arkansas Razorbacks and the Ole Miss Rebels in the Egg Bowl. Should be a couple fun games. Arkansas 7-3 and three on the season. Uh, doing quite well for themselves. They are a top 30 offense. They like to run the football, 193 yards per game. Pretty good uh, turnover differential as well, and points per game, over 30. So not too shabby. We are number one in points per game, of course. Number five offense, number one turnover differential. Uh, they've been having a great season, and here's our matchup against Ole Miss. The record doesn't matter. They're five and four, and, uh, you know, the ranking's not really good, but it's a rivalry game, so anything can happen in that one. What up, Tyler? What's going on, buddy? Well, let's see what Arkansas has done this season so far. And while I'm scrolling, don't forget to slap the like button. And subscribe if you are new to the channel. We're going to be having an NCAA 07 Dynasty on the channel coming up soon. So definitely stick around for that. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, Arkansas lost to Oregon to start off the year. Beat Northern Illinois, beat Arkansas State, beat Alabama, Kentucky, lost to Auburn, lost to Florida, beat Ole Miss by uh, quite a bit, four touchdowns, beat Louisiana Tech, beat South Carolina. All right, so they've had some, some pretty decent wins, I guess. And after this game, all they have left is LSU for this season. All right, let's get it. I'm ready. And I hope you are too. What's going on, John? What is up, my brother? Hope you're doing well, man. I almost hit start right there with the wrong playbook. Man, I would have been furious. All right, hopefully our games tonight are not as sloppy as the games last night. Man, I don't know what was going on uh, in our last game that we just had <coughs> against Tennessee uh, we just couldn't run the football and against Alabama I mean that was a stinker of a game I and mean, we fumbled the ball eight times eight but that's got to be a record and I don't think we fumbled a single option play in that entire game it was just rainy and nasty let's go boys Let's go, dogs. It's time for some fierce SEC action. Hi, everybody. I'm Brad Nessler, along with Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreet. We're really excited you could join us today for another great college football rivalry. The Razorbacks may be overmatched and could have an ugly game on their hands. Any thoughts, Kirk? Uh, there's no question about it. This one's going to be pretty ugly. Mississippi State has so many weapons on offense, and one of them is their outstanding wide receiver. This defense better not blink their eyes, because if they do, he's gone. Forget about it. Arkansas does not match up <coughs> defensively against this passing attack. And that's the reason why I think they're going to be out of this one early. It wouldn't surprise me one bit if it's over by halftime. Thank you, guys. You know, last time you said that, Lee, it was not over by halftime. All right. All right, I guess we're getting the ball first. Arkansas electing to kick it off, uh, surprisingly. Hope everybody's having a great week so far. It's hump day. Freshman running back McCoy set to return from the three-yard line. Oh, nice shoot to the outside. There goes McCoy with his 90-plus speed up to the 42 Hot start for the Bulldogs. See if we can get our running game going. Like I said, you know, against Tennessee, we just were getting stonewalled left and right. We had a couple opportunities, but, you know, the blocking just broke down. Man. Malone needs to 
hold on to that block for just a split second longer. Just haven't been able to get Sanford out in, in the open field. Hey, what up, Colin? Long time no see, buddy. Hope you're doing well. You're early. <laughs> That's right. You just caught the very first drive of the stream. Alright, third down and two. Don't chuck it. Try to. Malone! Oh, he caught it! Oh my goodness! No way! Touchdown, Bulldogs! Oh, that was glorious! What a beautiful sight! Give me the replay! Oh, man! Ball came right at us. Deflected right into Malone's hands. Beautiful! You need more cowbell? What's up, Jax? What's going on, brother? You know, I did have a cowbell sound saved onto my, my computer. My old one. And, uh, well, it died, so <laughs> there went my sound, and I can't find it. Hot start. Great kick return to start off by the freshman running back. And a quick touchdown, just a minute off the clock. Bulldogs on top, 7 nothing. Glad you're doing well, Callan. Love to hear that, buddy. Get him. Oh, I miss. I'm terrible. I'm terrible at the game. All right. Let's go, defense. Uh-oh. That was a good run. Nice carry by Booker. Some good blocking up front. Love to see that for the Arkansas fans. Not for me, but for them. Like button has been smashed like me. Oh boy, John. <laughs> Come on, man. That's tough. <laughs> that is tough. Oh man. I zigged right there when I should have zagged. Alright. Quick third down here. Third and one. Razorbacks, fifth in the country on third down, 53%. That is pretty damn good. Let's go, boys. Get him. Oh, my goodness. Let's go. Is that Mason? <coughs> Man, that was a perfect blitz call. You love to see it. See if we can block one. Nope, not this time. Come on, Calhoun. Get back there and block somebody. Or not. That's cool. Nice return by Mullins up to the 48-yard line, though. Some good returns by the special teams so far in this game. Very nice. Alright, what shall we do here? Okay, that's easy yards. Oh my goodness, Cletus just took that man's ankles. Beautiful. He's not the fastest quarterback, but he can take off when he wants to, especially when there's just 20 yards of open field in front of him. And if we can't run the dang ball with a running back, why not get the quarterback involved? Quarterbacks had five touchdown runs in the past uh, couple games. Sanford just won. Oh, couldn't hit him with the spin. Decent run, though. Pickup of six. We'll take that. Second down and four. And Sanford falling forward does not pick up the sticks. Oh, no. Third and inches. Of course, they're going to go goal line. Get it. Oh, 
he's tired. He's tired. Still got the first down. Up to the 15. It's a good run. Got an extra blocker with the tight end here on the right. And we still somehow get sacked. <laughs> oh my goodness. <coughs> oh man. That's unfortunate. You're gonna have to do a lot of binge watching to catch up. Yeah, absolutely. Come on, pace. Nice to know we let him go to the national championship. Yes. Yeah, that was a great season. This series has been a blast. I, I really enjoyed bringing it back. The series that started the channel. Oh, nice tackle. Dang. Okay. I guess we're kicking a field goal. That's fine. Yeah, that national championship game. Oh, and especially the SEC title game before that were instant classics. Two of the best games of all time on this channel. Rick Hayes, still perfect. Kicking field goals on the season. He's been outstanding. We haven't needed a game-winning field goal or anything, but I think if we need one, he can deliver. Get him, Gray. Oh, I missed. Oh, but he didn't. Get the... No way we don't dive on that. Are you serious? Oh, no. That is crazy. We had three defenders there. Just couldn't jump on the fumble. There we go. Oh, I got crushed. Oof. Put that shoulder just right through my chin. Bring down at six. Quick pass. And, oh my goodness. Gray almost picks it off, but Diaz gets the nice reception for the first down for the Razorbacks. Saves the touchdown, but that was a 70 yard reception for Bush. I don't know what just happened out on coverage right there. Barry just. He's lost. <laughs> he is lost. And Gray was way off target as well. Let's go, boys. Get the goal line stand. Here we go. I'll take that. You're not going to run it on me, all right? You're just not doing it. I'm going to blitz two linebackers now. They're pretty good in the red zone. 89%. That's 10th best. Option. Oh, that was perfect. Oh, my goodness. Great blocking. Can't believe the quarterback actually was able to pitch that out. Hats off to him. That was great. Really well executed. It's been a pretty quick first quarter, I think. Extra point up. And good. It's 10 to 7. Here in Starkville, Mississippi. Let's go, Mullins. Oh, I juked way too early. That's all right. All right. C 
see if we can get our running back some yards. <coughs> he averages like 150 a game, but against Tennessee, he just I think he had like 70 yards maybe with like a 2.4 yard uh, average. It was terrible. Not helping his his Heisman dreams that he's got. All right, let's see. Let's get some blocking on the right side here, huh? I did. I pitched it to the fullback. Okay. I like it. Get the big fellow to carry. You know, get him a first down. And that'll end the first quarter. We're on top, ten to seven. Over our rivals, the Arkansas Razorbacks. We're looking for our eleventh win on the season. And they're just stacking the box. That's all that's happening right now. No matter what formation I'm picking, as soon as I pick a run, they just know. They know what I'm doing. Let's try to get them with play action then. But of course now they'll back off the secondary. Come on, boys. And nice catch by the tight end, Anderson. Okay. We'll take that. Threw that one on a rope. Our next dynasty, we're definitely going to be utilizing tight ends a lot more. Pace, two for two, 78 yards and a touchdown today. Really efficient. I like it. And Sanford just cannot... Break through to the second level. <coughs> second down and eight. Massey back of the end zone, and that is well overthrown, incomplete. Third down coming up. He's wide open. And it's Malone for his second touchdown catch of the game. What a throw that was. Dotting up the secondary. Really good blocking by the O-line as well. Post Malone scoring on the post. How fitting. Turn up to the 35 yard line. That is not replay worthy. Get out of here. <coughs> Man. What am I supposed to do here? There we go. Nice tackle. Let's go, Robbins. Good job, buddy. Again, do not forget to vote on the community poll on the channel for what conference you want to see us play in for our NCAA 07 Dynasty. Currently, the MAC is winning the votes over the Big Ten and the Pac-10. So make your voice heard and cast your vote. I'm going to leave that up for about another week or so. Uh-oh. Oh my goodness, Gray just falls right over. <laughs> Jeez. Alright, let's go 3 4. Let's 
go, boys. Nice. Let's go. Campbell with a nice tackle. He's a very good linebacker. <laughs> if I lose you, unsub. Oh, no. That's tough. Don't do that, man. All right, we're trying to hit 1,400. Every time we get close, I lose, like, one subscriber. <laughs> like, what's going on, guys? Why don't you like me? Probably Ole Miss fans, honestly. Oh my goodness. Barry, what are you doing? He's fired. That's it. We gotta let him go. Better win 1,400 games in a row then. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that would be really fun to watch. Man, I gotta work on a slider set for 07. Unless anybody's got some suggestions for the sliders. If you do, uh, send it to me on Discord. And I'll, I'll test them out in my free time. Before we get our, our dynasty going. Oh, I slowed him down at least. All right. I don't know how he stayed up. They're down at four. Let's go cover two. Raise the backs. Two for three on third down in this contest. Good defense. No way. Oh, my goodness. I got such a weird animation with Kennedy. And another first down for our Kansas. That's unfortunate. Tight end around. I hate that. I hate that play with a passion. Luckily, I saw it coming. Stopped it in its tracks. Second to go from the four. Two and a half minutes remaining in the first half. And they are going to easily get in the end zone here. Touchdown, William. And they're going to close the gap. Just a little bit more. About to be 17 14. Extra point is good. It is 17 14. Bulldogs uh, just allowed a, a great drive right there. Defense just had no answer for that offense. Let's go, McCoy. Let's go, baby. Okay, no spin. All right, bet. Awesome. All right. I'm going to go play action. I've done it a couple times, and it's worked quite well for us so far. Maybe Massey or Malone on the corner. I'm just going to take off. Take an easy first down with Cletus. I really wanted to throw that deep, but <laughs> we'll just take the free yards. Let's try to hit some corner routes. High snap. Dang it. I was waiting for the receiver to cut up field, but Mullins just wasn't feeling it, I guess. <coughs> Dang it. Massey's wide open. Nice catch. Inside the 40-yard line. I like it. I'm telling you, play action, man. It's working right now. <coughs> Massey.
Cassidy over 1,400 yards for his career now. 15 tutties. Uh-oh. Up top. And Massey has another one this time all the way inside the 10 down to the 9. Arkansas really having a tough time deciphering if we're running it or throwing it. Kind of freezing their DBs just enough for our guys to get open downfield. Oh my goodness. Anderson, you got to hold that block, buddy. Come on. We cannot run the football right now, and it just blows my mind. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Looks like you're going to have to unsub. Oh my goodness. That's tough. Oh, come on. Cletus? Should have been a touchdown. Hmm. What shall we do? They're down at nine. Oh my goodness. We almost got in the end zone there. <laughs> that was crazy. Well, do we go for it here or do we just get the points? I'm just going to get the points. We got to kick it off to to start the third quarter, so I don't want to miss points here. And then have them maybe go downfield and get points before the half and then get the ball right back immediately. Well, disappointing end of that drive, but we are still on top 20 to 14 now. 32 seconds left in the first half. I just cannot break off of blocks. <coughs> really wish I would stop coughing. Get them, boys. And they called the timeout. Okay. Not sure about that. Robbins, what are you doing? Come on, man. That was terrible coverage. Pretty good season for Bush. 2,100 yards, 19 touchdowns, just 7 picks. Not too shabby. Barry, you got beat. Oh my goodness. What a throw. Dang it. That wide receiver is at least, you know, five or six inches taller than Barry. This is the exact opposite of what I wanted to happen to end the first half. Maybe we can block this extra point. All right, we are losing 21 to 20. Crowd is not happy. Arkansas always plays us tough, though. Okay, just don't block. That's fine. All right, what are we going to do here? What do I want to do? Oh, he's wide open. What a bad throw that was. Dang it. Move 
out of the way. Oh, dang it. All right, so we're down 21 to 20 at halftime. Arkansas having themselves a pretty good day on offense. They're hanging right there with us. 228 yards of offense, 255 for the Bulldogs. No turnovers yet in this one. We should have at least had a fumble recovery. But we suck, so. All right, defense. We need a quick stop here. That would be nice. We only have 31 rushing yards right now. I think that's what that said. Oh my goodness, turn your head around and you can get an interception easily right there. Bush, 7 of 8, 197 yards and a touchdown. Nice tackle. Oh, they have 31 rushing yards, we have 89. Okay, that makes more sense. Let's go man coverage, cross the board. I get the half back. No way. Oh my goodness. I'm fired. I'm firing myself right now. Never playing defense again. We can just get some pressure on this guy. That'd be nice too. Hey, I deflected the ball. Or knocked it out, at least. Just the second incomplete pass of the game for Arkansas. down and one from the 44 yard line. It's like two inches they have to get. Come on boys. Okay. <coughs> Quarterback is on fire. And so is TCU apparently. Number two team in the land. Beating people 40 to nothing. take that. Thank you. The user interception, baby. Let's go. Don't try me with a sorry receiver like that. Don't do it. Yeah, he just overthrew him by a little bit too much there. Alright, where is halfback tackle? There it is. run for Sanford. Best of the day for him. Uh-oh. Yeah, we're just going to run out of bounds. Nobody was open there. Not going to force anything either. Not a close game like this. If we were winning by a bunch, I'd take some chances. Oh, he tried a one-handed catch. What are you doing, Sanford? You don't got hands like that, bro. Come on, man. You got two hands for a reason. Oh my goodness. Our best receiver can't even catch a wide open touchdown. What's happening? He would still be running. He'd probably just be getting to the end zone right now. 
That's that's just so sad. Oh, I got killed. Let's go, Calhoun. Nice tackle. Little guy. Little fella. He threw one pick, and now he's throwing it 30 yards away from his receivers. I love it. Draw play, and he'll pick up four. Corbin May makes the stop. Coming through on the blitz. High snap, quarterback draw, get him. Oh, no way. How does Corbin May not chase him down? He's got like 85, 86 speed. No, what are we doing? Everybody's just lost out here. Somebody help me, please. Okay, pick up a four. Nice deflection, Kennedy. Let's go. Just barely got a hand on that. Let's go, boys. Robbins with a nice deflection. We finally get the third down stop. And they're going to go for it, naturally, because why not? I don't want to cover him. Okay, thank you. I'm stuck on the dang receiver. Come on. That is super frustrating. Defense is getting gashed today. Yep, there's some more of it. Good lordy. So 3 4 isn't working either, so that's cool. Barry nearly has the interception. So close. If only he came away with that. All right, then. Another amazing drive from Arkansas. We just can't do anything to stop them. Not even a good passing team either, really. And that's all they're doing against us. Can't stop them. Zero answers. We are down 28-20 now.
undefeated season on the line. Oh, come on. You gotta get that block. That could have been a huge return. Just came out of nowhere. Alright, they're going zone defense. Yeah, that's that's awesome. Alright. Really cool. Bounce right off of the running back's head. Awesome. Get some pressure on them, boys. There we go. Take that. And looks like they'll kick the field goal here. We're going to go safe, man. Field goal is up. And he's got it. 31 to 20. We have done nothing in the third quarter. Can I get a block, please? Oh, my goodness. Could return McCoy. Okay. Just did all that myself right there. We're going to the air. Yeah, why not? What? Oh my goodness, Massey, what are you doing? Oh, I hate that animation so much. Looking, uh, looking pretty grim right now, fellas. I mean, Massey didn't even try. Hit triangle, and he just throws his hands towards his face. Play Kennedy. Let's go defense. Let's go. That was a huge stop. And that will end the third quarter. We're down 11. 3120 here in Starkville, Mississippi. Get your fours up, boys. We need a big, big fourth quarter right now. Oh, nice block. Jeez. Didn't even try. <laughs> All right, here we go. And Malone wide open on the corner route. Three 
catches, 102 yards and two touchdowns. His first catch today that wasn't a score. Uh oh. Take off, Cletus. Juke him out. Woo. We'll take that. I think Pace might be leading our team in rushing yards right now, which is ridiculous. Sanford has been a non-factor the last couple games. Oh my goodness. Sandoval, you have to block somebody, my guy. What? I mean, what are we doing? We get down in the red zone and we just forget how to play football. Nobody's getting open. Oh, man. Super frustrating. Third down and ten coming up. Can't get a first down. We just got to get it right next to the goal line. Oh, my goodness. Sanford, let's go. Touchdown, Bulldogs. Thank goodness he turned around for that. Thought it was going to hit him in the back of the head. That's a huge touchdown. And now, uh, we gotta go for two. Gotta do it. <coughs> that was way too easy. Let's go. Malone with a two-point conversion and two touchdowns today. And it's 31-28. Got ourselves a ball game. Five and a half minutes remaining. Calhoun on the tackle at the 20. Now let's get a takeaway. Undefeated season on the line. Trying to get back to the national title game. That's a fumble. That's ours. Let's go, Kennedy. Let's go. Touchdown, Mississippi State. And just like that, we reclaimed the lead. Oh, that was glorious. The backward pass, fumble, touchdown return. I was not letting Corbin May get that. I wanted it for Kennedy. The crowd going bananas. And we desperately needed that. That's a game changer. Hayes, extra point is up, and it is good. 35 31. Bulldogs on top. Get him, Becker. I missed. <laughs> oh, well. All right, back to defense. Back at it again, boys. Man, that pass somehow squeezes in there to Diaz for the first down. Corbin May on the stop, I believe. No, it was Mason, his eighth tackle today. Middle linebacker. Big third down here. Or second down and 12, rather. Okay, okay, okay. Let's settle down, Booker. With his 3.2 yard average. Probably just as good as Sanford is today. Play action. 
Nice deflection at the line of scrimmage. Don't see that too often. Bush having a great game. He had the one pick and a costly backwards pass. Other than that, he's been playing fantastic. Oh, no. Good run by the fullback Carter, picking up seven. Go whip man. Let's go. Kennedy gets a paw up in the air, deflects it down. And it's fourth and three. Obviously, they have to go for it here. It's a big play. And a false start on the right guard. Costly mistake for the Razorbacks. And now they're going to punt it away. Let's go punt return safe. Man, I don't trust it. Man, that's going to go into the end zone. Gunner didn't even try. See if we can't get some first downs here. And Sanford picks up nine. We'll take that. Nice block by Sandoval. Spring him three into that second level for a couple extra yards. Nice blocking and a nice juke. Sanford to the 43, one of his best runs today. 74 yards on the ground for him now. Pace with 54. Taking on Ole Miss after this one, so stick around for our final regular season game of season number nine. Another nice juke by Sanford. He's going to pick up nine, and he's injured his leg on the play. That is huge. Hopefully it's nothing serious. That is not good. You hate to see that. Yates in there at halfback. Not second in inches. And he will get absolutely crushed, but he gets the first down. Just pulled hamstring for Sanford, so breathing a sigh of relief right now. That would have been a major catastrophic blow to this offense for the last several games. Oh my goodness, Sandoval breaking tackles, picking up the first. Nice run by the big fella. <laughs> What's up, Marvin? Smack it, flip it, rub it up. Oh my goodness, rub it down. Caress that like button. All right. Yates still in there at halfback. Not sure if we're going to see Sanford for the rest of the game. Did say he was going to return, but maybe not on this drive. Try to run this clock down as much as we can. And Yates will pick up three. Arkansas are going to finally start calling some timeouts now. They've got two remaining. And Yates gets another yard, maybe two on that play. Down to five. This is a big play. Right. 
Up top, Massey's got the first down. That was a gutsy call. Didn't want to run it, though. They were just stacking the box. We needed that first down. And boy, did we get it. Just one time out left for him. I think they technically could get the ball back if they stop us. But we're not going to let that happen. As Sanford moves the chains again. He's got 95 yards. Here's the backs call the final timeout. 103 left in the ballgame. And Sanford is in for six. And that should do it. That should get him over 100 yards rushing for the game as well. He really had to fight for it in this one. Tough run. Neither team over 400 yards of offense, but I'm sure Arkansas is about to get that on this next drive coming up. Extra point is up, and they hit our kicker. Don't be hurting my kicker now. 42 to 31 now. 59 seconds left in the game. Kicking this as high as it can go. Come on, get there. Get there. Oh. We had a big fourth quarter, which is exactly uh, what I said we needed to be able to come out of this uh, game with a dub. Greg, Greg, what are you doing, brother? You're like playing 10, 15 yards off of him. Just wide open. And that puts Arkansas over 400 yards of offense. They're not going to give up just yet. That should have been a pick by the linebacker. I couldn't see his number. Who was that? That was Copeland. And nice catch by McIntyre. Man, we are all over there, and we just can't make a play on the ball. Ridiculous. Oops. That's a, oh, that looked like it might have been a backwards pass. Kennedy played the game, had the pick, and they scoop and score off the backwards pass. And Corbin uh, just doesn't, <laughs> doesn't even turn his head. Ball hits him uh, on his nameplate. And we finally get a sack on the quarterback. And it's Williams, young defensive lineman, making a nice play. Fourth and 16 coming up. And they are going to get a touchdown. Oh, my goodness. Double coverage, and they come away with it. Unbelievable. Got to give it up to Arkansas, though. They just have no quit in them whatsoever. Get it, boys. And they do not get the two-point conversion. We're going to have to go for the onside kick. I accidentally hit the button too quickly. Got to send down the hands team here. 42-37 is the score. Oh my goodness. 
That would have been insane to return, return that for a touchdown. Well, that will do it. This was the game of the week. Let's turn the commentary back on for the end of this game here. Game of the week, and we win our rivalry game 42-37. And now we will uh, go take on Ole Miss. And they make the stop at the 46. Nothing going on that one. This is just a tough, tough loss to take. Arkansas has got to be heartbroken to lose such a close game as this one was. They came in as huge underdogs, but they played their hearts out and almost came away with a big upset. That concludes another game of NCAA Football 2003. And again, our final score, Mississippi State 42, Arkansas 37. From all of us here at EA Sports, we hope to see you again soon. Goodbye, everybody. Hail State, baby, let's go. Arkansas's offense was disgusting. They were really good. And we had no penalties. That's uh, that's a big shocker, actually. Pigs got porked. Yeah, I mean, look at that fourth quarter. You know, before we entered the fourth quarter, I said it had to be a big one. And, man, our, our team just delivered. We got a touchdown from Pace to Sanford. That was a great drive. It was clutch. And the very next drive, uh, the first play on offense, I think it was the first play on offense for Arkansas. They threw it backwards, and Kennedy scoops it up and turns it for a touchdown. And Sanford, another touchdown. Just beautiful. Pace, 50%. Over 200 yards, three touchdowns. Sacked once. Sanford, 101 yards, touchdown. Pace had 54 on the ground as well with a fumble that we did lose. Malone and Massey, both with three catches. Malone with 102 yards, two touchdowns. Sanford had the other score. And a drop. Mason was going crazy. Four tackles for a loss. Chris Williams, the rest of freshman, gets a sack. Kennedy with the pick. Seven deflections for the defense. Force fumble for Calhoun, recovered by Kennedy. For the touchdown. Hayes still perfect on the year. Two for two today. And Pete Floyd still really good uh, on his punting average. So, really nice. Alright, let's go and uh, take on Ole Miss. Let's get it, boys. Back-to-back -back rivalry games. I believe we've already won our division. Let's take a look at that quickly uh, before we jump into this game and see what's happening there. I'm pretty sure we already won our, our division now. Not sure about the other division. We will save this real quick. Look at Auburn just beating Alabama 59 to nothing. Alabama, I don't think they've won in the last three seasons. And it's <laughs> it's just crazy to think about with all of the you know real life success that the Tide have had over the last 20 years. Well, not 20, but 15. 17-ish. Arizona State, 1-11 to finish the year. Man. Air Force got a shutout, so that's cool. Well, while I'm sitting here, let me check the voting. On... The community poll. Let's see what's happening here. Alright, the Big Ten's catching up to the MAC just a little bit. 38% for the Big Ten, 47% for the MAC, and the Pac 10, just 15% of the vote. So nobody's feeling the West Coast vibes, I guess. And that's alright. Whatever you guys want to see. All right, here we go. Egg Bowl. Ole Miss, they just lost again. They're 5-5. Five and five. They need a win here to make a bowl game. 
we are no longer number one in points per game. It's going to be Oklahoma. They are just killing everybody in sight. Colorado's also really good this season. Pretty sure Oklahoma's the only team to beat them. TCU, 10-0. Crazy. Look at Notre Dame with a winning record. All right, let's look at our, our conference real quick. Whoops. That's, that's not what I want. Standings, there we go. What the heck am I doing? Alright, so the East is either going to be Florida or Georgia this season instead of Tennessee. Thank goodness. I'm sick and tired of facing the Volunteers. I'm sick of it. And obviously, uh, yeah, even if we lose this game, we're, we're in the SEC Championship game. But uh, let's just not lose. Let's do that, huh? That's not what I wanted. Not what I wanted. Port card, 26 wins in a row. We now have 100 victories to just 20 losses in almost nine full seasons. And it is absolutely beautiful. All right, let's go take on Ole Miss in the Egg Bowl. Let's get it. See, tomorrow's Thursday. We'll probably do the uh, SEC championship game tomorrow night. And then Friday night, we'll do our bowl game. Whatever bowl game we will be in. Got to win these next two games first to see where we're at. But if we could somehow get back into the title game, man, that would be so sweet. Welcoming you to another exciting college football battle as the bowl picture starts to take shape. The Rebels appear to be completely overmatched in this one. What do you think, Kirk? Well, I think you're right. I think this one's going to be a blowout. Mississippi State had so many weapons on offense, and one of them is their outstanding wide receiver. This defense better not blink their eyes, because if they do, he's gone. Yep, no question, Kirk. Ole Miss does not match up well defensively against this passing attack. And that's the reason why I think they're going to be out of this one early. It wouldn't surprise me one bit if it's over by halftime. You know, you know, Lee, you keep saying it's over by halftime, but it's just not the case, buddy. You don't know the uh, concept of rivalry games, I guess. Man, okay, so both games today, Arkansas and Ole Miss elect to kick it off to me to start. I don't really like that. I like getting the ball in the third quarter. Where the heck did he come from? My goodness. Alright, I want to run the football. Please. Someone block. Somehow we got yards out of that. <laughs> I don't know. It's been such a struggle to run the ball lately. Like, nothing has changed. We didn't lose any linemen. Still got our running back. Let's throw it. Why not? Nice catch by the tight end, Anderson. Did not think we were going to be able to throw the ball, actually. We got crushed. That's not okay.
Why are you diving? Oh, man. That should have been intercepted. Going man coverage here? Nope, zone coverage. Pace. Reaching forward. He's going to move the chains. Malone's got him beat on the corner, and he lays out for it. Nice deflection by Rollins, the strong safety. And there's holding. Dang it. Well, that... <laughs> Kind of puts a damper on trying to run the ball. Okay. This drive is dead in the water right now. Third down and 28 for the dogs. And Massey can't get a hand on it. That was a, an absolute tragedy right there. A drive had promise, too. Oh, that's not good. Okay. Okay, that was beautiful. Let's go. All the way inside the 10 yard line. 61 yard punt for Pete Floyd, the freshman. Now, Ole Miss, they do like to throw the football quite a bit. See how the secondary holds up. Arkansas was tearing us apart from start to finish the last game. And Paulding starts off with a 9 yard catch. Isn't that lovely? so hard to dive on those. Alright, let's see. Third down and eight. Let's go with Nickel. Get some extra speed out there. Do not let him beat us with a quick pass, please. And Kennedy with a nice deflection. Alright. Defense holds up their end of the bargain. Oh, this could be good. Oh, nice tackle at the 35 yard line. Great field position to start off. time I pick a run play lately, they just know. They know what's happening. Lucky to get any yards right now. They're either blitzing or just completely stacking the box. And I don't like it. It's not cool, man. Up top. Anderson, the tight end. He's got it down to the one-yard line. Now that I do like. That was a great route, great throw.
and my goodness, Sanford crushing the backfield. Yeah, they definitely recognize the run game, Marvin. I mean, it's pretty evident right there. It's like, jeez, man. They just know. They know. Let's try a toss play. This could work. It's going left. If the fullback hits somebody. Oh, man. He did, but unfortunately there was two other guys. Man. Let's go option. From the three-yard line. Lead his pace. Touchdown, MSU. All right. Man, that was just such a struggle. We get inside the 10-yard line, I don't know what happens. We got to fight for every inch. At least we're on the board now. 7 nothing. Bulldogs with the lead. Man, I just got crushed. Get him, Campbell. Or not. That's cool. Don't worry about it. That was kind of scary. Not going to lie to you. No, I don't want to watch that again. He nearly broke that. Get him, boys. Get him! It's alright, they're going backwards. That's fine with me. Might not be recovering these fumbles, but they got negative yards of offense right now. Which is just a little bit silly. That was a loss of eight. Dang. Okay. Alright then. I didn't know Steve Smith played for Ole Miss. Running over everybody. Oh, I'm not sure what happened there. It might have been pass interference, but refs didn't see it. Didn't feel like calling it. Quick pass. Brown picks up two. And that was... Who was that? That was Bullock on the stop. The defensive end helping out in uh, in the pass. Pass defense. And an overthrow. Okay. We'll take that stop. Powered on for the punt. Had a 42-yarder earlier. But it was a good return by Mullins up to the 35 of Ole Miss. That set up the touchdown drive. Man, he really likes kicking to the sideline, huh? I knew it. I knew it. I knew it was going to happen. I felt that in my bones. It's so unfortunate. Poor defense. They're playing lights out and now they're at the 15 yard line whatever yeah okay oh man that's so unfortunate seven all now here in the egg bowl Flag all the way to the 35 yard line. Let's go offense. Let's figure it out. 
Quick pass. And Mullins. I mean, I'm getting him out of there. I, I just, I'm sick and tired of seeing him. To be honest with you guys. I really am. Who else wants to play? Joiner, you get out there. Do something. He just has not been very good. I don't like this at all. Take that though, eight yards, not bad. They're down at two. Of course, they're gonna stack the box here. I'm stuck, I got stuck on my fullback. Oh my goodness. So frustrating. Why can I not run the ball anymore? Just gonna let this run the first quarter out. We are all tied up. Seven apiece in Oxford, Mississippi in the Egg Bowl. Rebels looking to become bowl eligible with, their, with a sixth win today. Bulldogs looking to go 12-0 in the regular season. And that was a good kick. All the way to the 10-yard line. Secondary is just asleep at the wheel. Oh no. No way Robbins doesn't pick that. Oh my goodness. You gotta be kidding me. That is so ridiculous. Wow. I mean, he's right there for it. We just don't want to win today. That's fine. I mean, I want to win. The defense doesn't. Not sure who he's trying to go to there. Not a good throw. a little bit of an overthrow and it's third down and 10 to go from the 17 oh my god always out of position always Seven Ole Miss on top. And Mullins finally does something. go Desmond Dale touchdown MSU let's go beat him like he stole something that was a beautiful thing 
That has doubled our offensive output for the day. And about to tie this thing back up. I mean, if I can't run it, I'm, I'm just going to chuck it all game. I just don't even care. Whatever works. They have been killing Sanford in this game. defense let's do something anything don't make me do all of it please I'll get every deflection I'll make every tackle I'll get interceptions I'll do it if I have to but I'd like to not have to do everything I'll sack the quarterback we don't do that very often that's for sure Good play by Robbins. It's going to be a loss of four yards on a pass play. Love to see that. Third and 14 for the Rebels. Come on, boys. What are we doing? What are we doing? Come on. If we could just get any form of pressure on this quarterback that would be fantastic hopefully when we play 07 we can get more sacks every game what he could have just ran for 20 yards my goodness settle down buddy Pretty uh, middle of the road career for Warren under center for Ole Miss. And that ball is going to hit Campbell in the backside. And it's third and ten. He has to take off, and we actually stop him. Oh, my goodness. We did a thing. Corbin May with the tackle. Had me nervous for a second. It looked like he was going to get it. All right. That was a decent return. I'll take that. scared. I'm nervous. Sanford drops it. Should have been an easy first down. But he just does not want to be a baller today. Oh my goodness, Dale. You did not have to dive like that for the catch. Oh boy. That's tough. All right, they're down at seven for the dogs. I'm going to try to hit Malone over the middle. Can't do it. Throw it up. Massey, and he's going to drop it. Dang it. The big fella had it in his hands. Couldn't come away with it. Disappointing. Come on, nice blocking. No way, get out of here. 
So ridiculous. Nope, not watching that again. No, sir. We could never break tackles like that. cover. Can't tackle. Can't win with him. Can't do it. Okay, Copeland. Alright, let's just all fall down. It's <laughs> man. It's like we're at a bowling alley and we are the bowling pins. Somebody make a play, please. Or not. That's cool. All right, so a touchdown on this. They're going to take the lead back. Again, these guys are going to get the ball to start the second half. So uh, I'd like to get the ball and get down the field and get a touchdown, tie this thing up. Extra point up and good. 21-14 here in Oxford. Couple tough games tonight. Yeah, man, get him off of my team. Let's just try to give the game away, right? Get out of here. You're garbage. You're actually just so bad for no reason. I mean, how many fumbles does he have this year? It's insane. I can't believe it. Malone has him beat. He's got it. Inside the 20. We'll take it. Let's go. Pace showing that cannon. Of an arm. And Malone just outrunning three defenders. He's just so good. Now, if only we could run the football. Let's go, Sanford. Oh, come on. You should have got that block. Touchdown, Bulldog. Let's go. Ask and you shall receive. A rushing touchdown. That might have been too quick of a score, though. Because now the Rebels get the ball back uh, with a minute 48 remaining in the half. But the good news is we tied it up. Or at least we're about to tie it up with the extra point from Rick Hayes. Kicks up and kick is good. 21 all. Took just 25 seconds to score. I just want the defense to do something. had it. Come on, Ruben. Oh, no, that was Corbin May. No, that was not him that made that play. That was definitely Ruben Mason, our middle linebacker.
There we go, Robbins. Okay. Quick third down. Where are you going? Where's it going with that? Nowhere. Get out of here. Not a lot of rushing yards in this first half for either team. Dang it. Come on, Calhoun. Oh my goodness. I thought I took him off. I took him off kick return. Alright, well he's doing good on punt return at least. Doing something. Besides just fumbling my football. He's running steps all day. Man, nice deflection. get there. Nice catch by Malone. He's so good. One-handed snag. All the way inside the 15-yard line. First down, Mississippi State. That was beautiful. Let's go, Sanford. Touchdown, Bulldogs. Last two carries have been touchdowns. Just what the doctor ordered. Look at that speed burst into the second level. Running over a safety, carrying a linebacker for the score. Is up and good. Bulldogs with the lead. Two quick scores, taking less than a minute off the clock. And 28 21. Okay. Okay. You're right. We are missing so many tackles right now, it's absurd. I don't like it. Dang it. Let's get the ball back, get another score. Why not? He is throwing backwards. What is going on? Third down and 12 for the Rebels at the 32 and a half yard line. And nice deflection, and we're going to get the ball back again. Turn from Mullins to the 44. Don't lose to a quarterback that has more INTs than touchdowns. I'm trying my hardest right now, Marvin. I really am, man. Up top. Malone again inside the 10 yard line. They just can't cover him. Single coverage, I mean, you got to get somebody else on him. Come on, boys, get to the line. Let's go. 
Oh my goodness. Lays out for it. Almost has it. I'm going to try the same play. Oh my goodness. He dropped it. Dang it. That was a great throw. Alright, we'll kick a field goal. Try to, at least. Come on, Thumb. Don't fail me now, brother. Field goal is up, and it is good from Rick Hayes. He's still perfect on the season. And we are on top 31-21 to 21 as we go into the locker rooms for halftime. That's huge because Ole Miss gets the ball to start the second half. No turnovers in this one. Bulldogs over 300 yards of offense. Rebels with 180, I believe it said. I missed. I missed terribly. Calhoun is so fast. Let's go, boys. Great. Great, what are we doing? Great, please. I may have hit square on accident. I'm trying to hit triangle. So that's my bad. My bad, man. Let's go. User interception. Get away from me right now. Return it up to the 40. That is my ball. Again, I have no tackles with Kennedy. <laughs> we had a game uh, last night, I believe, where I had no tackles with him as well. Get there. Oh, he overthrew him just a little bit too much. Malone's fast, but he ain't that fast. Okay, Sandoval, just don't even hit anybody. That's cool. Everything's fine. They're down an eight. Coming up. Oh, my goodness. That was pass interference. Come on, man. Everybody just got stuck in the middle. That's not cool. That is just not okay. There we go, get it. No way we don't recover that. Are you serious? Oh my goodness. I'm calling BS on that one. No way in the heck did we just not fall on that. We had so many guys diving for it. That's so insane. Great. Please. Please help me. big hit on the wide receiver. That's one thing I'm really looking forward to in the 07 Dynasty is hit sticking people. I, I cannot wait for that. Taunting as well. I'm taunting all day, baby. I'm doing it. Oh, my goodness. I mean, you can't defend that. Oh, 
Cole Copeland, come on, man. He could still be running down the sideline right now. Oh, hit him in the elbow. Use your hands, buddy, not your elbow. Come on now. Everyone seems to hate the return cam in 07. Assume the... Yeah, I mean, it's a good game. The, the return camera is the only thing, one of the very few things, I would say, uh, that I just don't like about that game. The fact that I can't turn that off. I hate the return camera so much. It's my least favorite addition to the college football games. But the rest of the game is really good. I mean, it's not, you know, it's almost, it's pretty much as good as 06. Honestly. Field goal is up, and it is good. Back to a seven point ball game. It's 31 24. Yeah, if the return camera wasn't in 07, I would have played that game so much more. It would already be on the channel. I will fight through my, my hatred for the return camera uh, to bring a new dynasty <laughs> to the channel. <coughs> so I really enjoy the rest of the game. I might just let the computer do the, the kick returns, honestly. There we go, Sanford. Oh my goodness. Oof. 67 yards, nice. Most of that is on like three carries. Malone, get there, brother. Laying out for it inside the 25-yard line. What a catch. Let's go. Almost bought 07 back in the day. Irked by a whole Mike Vick thing in Madden. Yeah. I mean, 08's pretty good, too. Get that, Anderson. Let's go inside the five yard line first and goal Bulldogs. You love to see it. Touchdown, MSU. Let's go. I had a great career in 07. I was a linebacker in the campus legend mode for Georgia Tech. I ended up winning the Heisman my senior season. It was so fun. I had like 12 interceptions, like 12 forced fumbles, like 10 recovered, a bunch of touchdowns. It was awesome. I, I still remember a lot of that. Wish I was able to record it back in the day. It was so fun. Had like 150 tackles. Alright, back to defense. It's 38-24 here in the third quarter. Trying to secure the perfect regular season here in the Egg Bowl in Oxford, Mississippi. Man, these guys are just trucking right through all of my guys, no matter who it is. Sort of 
quarterback draw. I missed. So did everybody else. I don't feel as bad now. in the middle of the field in pass defense. Not liking that. It's going to be nice to face somebody other than Tennessee in the SEC championship game this season. I'm sick and tired of facing them. I really am. It's like, yeah, let's just play the Volunteers twice a season. Every season. No thanks. Give me Georgia or Florida. Somebody. down at seven and Myers has the catch but I don't think he's got enough for the first down he does not they're gonna punt it away another decent return Mullins up to the 31 32 yard line Keep on throwing it. I'm doing it. I got crushed. That's not good. Dang it. That's the O-line's fault on that play. My goodness. That's a defensive lineman just running free. Oh, goodness. Just block. You know, just, just block for me. How hard is that? Come on, boys, get him. Oh, wide open. Oh, he dropped it. Oh, my goodness. Wow. That was really surprising. All right, they're going to kick a field goal, which is also surprising. Fourth and inches at the 17. I'd be going for it every time. Field goes up, and it is good. Money. 38-27. we got 11 seconds left here in the third quarter. A spin by Calhoun up to the 24. Final play of the third. We're going to draw play. I did not mean to do that. <laughs> oh, well. End of the third quarter, 38-27. Bulldogs on top. Get your fours up in the chat, boys. One quarter away from being 12-0. and 0. Kind of crazy that we've won 100 games and lost 20 in this series. That's a lot of football.
We're down eight. Man, oh my, are you serious? Wow, he was wide open. Should have been the easiest first down of his life. Instead, we're punting it away. And Ole Miss has some momentum now. Fair caught at the 30-yard line. guys over here. No way he caught that off the deflection. Holy smokes. Concentration was just ridiculous. Man, I don't know how he caught that. That was awesome. Rebels trying to close the gap. He's wide open and there's a drop pass. Okay. Apparently wide open. Uh, nobody can catch today, but double, triple coverage, you know, passes being deflected, catching all of that. Very interesting. Why, why is he taking so long? Just snap the ball, bro. Like, you're not fooling anybody with the hard count, my guy. with the hard count. Good lordy. That might be my first tackle of the game with Kennedy. Let's go. And deflected away by Robbins. Let's go. Third down and eight coming up. Let's do it. Copeland with a nice big hit. They hold him to the fourth down. They're going to kick another field goal. That'll make it an eight-point ball game if they can boot it through the upright. Walton, two of two today, along with 39. This one is also a 39-yarder, I believe, just about. Maybe 40. Kick is up, and the kick is good. Eight-point game. Another close one. Just cannot seem to get a big win over our rivals. I don't think we ever have in this series. Oh man, if I was able to juke to the outside, that could have been a nasty return. Rebels with all the momentum currently. Yeah, that play was blown right up. Let's try a counter. They'd really be rivals if you blew them out every time? That's true. But, you know, just once in a while it would be nice, wouldn't it?
And Malone, another one-handed catch. Oh my goodness, he's so crazy, man. Might have the best hands I've ever seen. Come on, Joiner, get that. Or not, that's cool. Everything's fine. Don't worry about it. It's like his first target in eight weeks. Pace just over 50% on the season. Ugh. Only if you're on the winning side. <laughs> it's okay, Marvin. Don't sulk, buddy. You got a new head coach out of it, all right? Got to feel good about that, right? Maybe. How you feeling about the Falcons next season? Sanford moving the chains, closing in on 100 yards. It is. It's been an uphill battle, but we're getting there. I need to run more clock. <laughs> or clock down here. Snapping the ball too quickly, I think. Hold those feelings to the draft. Too early to tell right now. Yeah, that's true. What do you want to see him do in the draft this season? Maybe a quarterback? You know, you can't sit there and tell me that Ritter is the answer. Because I won't believe you. Oh, this holding. No, 67 did it. It was Murphy. Rollins enters his knee on the play. All right, what do we do here? What do we do? What do we do? New quarterback definitely on the list. Yeah, Ritter's definitely not it, man. He was rough watching him play. No! Oh, no, we suck again. It's holding. Flags are flying. I don't want to talk about that throw. That was that was a very bad decision by me. I take full responsibility for that. Come on, we got pressure on him, and then we still can't get there. Pocket movement was crazy. Rollins out for the game with a knee bruise. Rebels down eight points. Nice deflection by Robbins. It's going to be an exciting finish here. We got 144 to go and 65 yards to have a shot at tying it. Let's go, Kennedy. I got a little scared. A little nervous right there. I was covering two guys. All right, fourth down and six. This could very well be for the ball game. Stick around after the game. We're going to see who we're going to be uh, taking on in the SEC championship game if we win. Or obviously, uh, we actually were already in it, so... No matter what, we're going to see. Good stop by the defense. Turnover on downs. Rebels do have uh, all three timeouts remaining, though. We're going to have to get a couple first downs here to put this one officially away. Get that block. Or not. That's cool. I would like for Sandoval to actually hit somebody. Like, just one time would be great. 
They've thrown it 48 times for 330 or 313 yards, two touchdowns and a pick. My goodness. Okay. Got to get two and a half yards, three yards here. And wow, we do not get it. We're not in field goal range either. I'm not trying a 47, 48 yard field goal. I'm going to run the clock down and call a timeout. Pick a better play. Because they already know what's happening right here. I might throw it here. Let's throw it. Why not? Either way, if we don't get it, clock's going to stop. So, might as well try. Nobody's open. We pitched it. Sanford. Oh, my goodness. Oh, baby. <laughs> All the jukes. First down. Sanford goes over 100 yards. That was a beautiful pitch to get us out of that situation. And we're just going to kneel it down. I don't care about the red zone percentage. They are out of timeouts. We're going to have to kneel it one more time. And we are going to be victorious here in the Egg Bowl. Yes, sir, Marvin. That seals the deal. Another close rivalry game. One score ball game. 38-30 is going to be the final. My pass defense is... Uh, Making me nervous. <laughs> if we go up against Oklahoma again or somebody like that in our bowl game, we're going to be in serious trouble. Sanford played the game over 100 yards, rushing three touchdowns for the sophomore as he makes uh, one last statement for the Heisman votes. There it is, though, 38-30. Ole Miss 5-6. Not sure if they have another uh, game here uh, next week to try for a bowl game, but they've lost three straight now. And we have won 27 in a row. Isn't it just beautiful? Let's take, check out the uh, stats here. They only had 335 yards of offense. Man, third down percentage was just... Nobody was having luck with those. Bunch of penalties. Uh, four penalties, 60 total yards. And we only scored one touchdown in the second half, but they only put up nine points as well. So, kind of a quiet second half for both squads. Just that 40 yard field goal by Walton in the fourth. I mean, this guy was killing us. Chad Warren. I mean, he was only 50%, but 313 yards? Dang. Pace, 330 yards. 41%. Terrible. But you know what? Sometimes you just got to win ugly. And especially, you know, you only got Ryan Malone getting open downfield. So, didn't have a touchdown, though. Desmond Dale had the 68-yard touchdown. Murphy with a pancake. He also had a holding call. Robin, seven tackles. Copeland, four. No sacks. Pick for Kennedy. Five deflections for Robin. Man. Mason and Copeland with forced fumbles. Couldn't recover any, though. Very sad. Rick Hayes, still perfect on the season. And Pete Floyd, long of 61 today. He, I mean, he's just crushing it in his freshman year. And Mullen, 60 yards on punt returns. And that'll do it. We're going to save it. Well, actually, we're going to simulate the week. All that fun, happy stuff. And then simulate to the conference championship week. See who we're going to be taking on. And then I will get on out of here, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.
with the title game. UNLV finally lost to somebody that wasn't us. TCU still undefeated. USC beats Notre Dame. LSU beating Arkansas. That's actually surprising. Army Navy, who we got? Who you got in the chat? Vote right now. Tell me. Simulating in three, two, one. And we're taking on Florida in the SEC Championship game. Miami, Ohio, and Bowling Green for the MAC title. And Colorado, Oklahoma for the Big 12 Championship winner. Uh, will most likely face me in the National Championship game. If we win our conference, of course. Pick Navy. Oh my goodness, that is a classic. What a game that was. 24-23, Navy beats Army. They don't get a bowl game, but they finish the season with some pride. That's a good game. I like that. All right, but that's it. This is our conference title game against the Florida Gators. Haven't faced them in, I, I want to say, like five or six seasons, honestly. Uh, but they have number three passing attack in the country. Should be interesting since we can't stop the pass whatsoever. And uh, I'm not looking forward to that. But <laughs> hopefully you guys are, though. If you haven't already, please slap the like button. Subscribe if you are new and join our Discord community. There's a link in the description below for that. And I will catch you all tomorrow night for our SEC Championship game against Florida. Until then, take it easy, guys.